All right, thank you, Ilana. In an exclusive story this evening, we're hearing from close friends of a man who died in a biking accident on Halloween. Yeah, his friends calling 63-year-old Jeff Page an adrenaline junkie. Page was a uh, C6-7 quadriplegic who loved the outdoors, even after a biking accident in 2015. They say Page figured out a way to keep biking and skiing through sheer hard work and determination. Now, Page was also a mountain bike racer and a mountain hill racer and event after his accident. He loved the adrenaline and the speed. His friend, Ed Schoner, saying that Paige loved, uh, lived close to the Jordan River Trail and would ride there multiple times a week, depending on the weather. They say this loss is still sinking in. After his accident, he didn't stop for one second. He said once he fell, when he broke his neck and he had lost sensation, he knew he was paralyzed. And it's like, Right at that instant, he started working on, okay, how can I overcome this? How am I gonna deal with this? Jeff was also a big mentor of mine in the adaptive industry. Basically everything I know about working on bikes is knowledge that I've came from, or learned from Jeff. And he always wanted to make sure that he was helping other people in the adaptive community. Those close to Jeff's story will be an inspiration to many. And um, Wasatch Adaptive Sports is hosting a memorial ride in Jeff Page's honor tomorrow at 1 p.m. That will start at Millrace Park in Taylorsville.